If you have cores on a high-speed fabric, and that high-speed fabric talks to the rest of the system, then kind of your cost to do everything goes up a little bit, mm -hmm. right? So um, if I'm running, say, Microsoft Teams, right. and you know I need a couple of cores, I want to keep it smooth, you want your video to play, you want your audio to play, subtitles, et cetera, right? Um, that's the kind of workload we want to get on that low-power island. So um, it's, it's sort of the minimum that you have to turn on to be functional. So with the low-power island, we don't have to turn on the ring, we don't have to turn on the P-cores, we have a shorter fabric to memory, and so that gives you the ability to have functionality and performance without some of that extra power cost. Uh, and then that leads to that improved battery life. So we could put it on the ring, it's just going to be slightly more power to accomplish that. Meteor Lake was our first step towards it. Yeah. So if you remember on Meteor Lake, we had two L L low power e-cores, yep. right? Yeah, so um, and that was because we wanted to kind of get to the ecosystem and say that, hey, now we have this low power island, let's start enabling them. It had some use cases that could fit on the low power island and e eventually it evolved into Lunar Lake having four cores on there. We could fit more stuff on uh, on the four, four LP e cores that we have, right? But what Meteor Lake helped us do is put one step forward on because it takes uh, time for software to evolve from, uh, you know, usage of just uh, 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 performance uh, mm -hmm. hybrid versus using now efficiency and things, yep. right? OS consuming hints that, hey, now I'm doing consolidation on one island. I recommend that use one die or one island more versus the other island for efficiency perspective. So Meteor Lake helped us get through that step. And we learned a lot from there and then we created Lunar Lake and now we have Panther Lake, right? So right. It, it really kind of is a continuous journey as I see it.